Hello there viewers, it's February the 24th, 2011, and if it's true what they say that patience is a virtue, then I'm pretty sure it's one you can add to your list, because this introduction video is two and a half years late. So yeah, introduction. Bam! My name's Mike, my online name is mzb993. I'll get to how I chose such a terrible username later. But first, I'll give you a quick rundown of what you can expect from this channel. Well, one thing you shouldn't expect is anything regular. Anyone that's been subscribed to me for more than a month could tell you that I'm absolutely terrible at keeping to schedules. But for the moment, I'm making about three videos a month. In terms of content, it tends to vary. A couple of years ago, even more so, I'd go from eating a spoonful of cinnamon one week, to lip syncing to wham the next. More recently I've been making mostly vlogs slash comedy videos, although quite often I do a challenge video or video response or sketch. Another thing about videos is when I'm inside they tend to be in black and white. The reason for this is a very long story which includes a colour blind chameleon and a hefty lawsuit. But the only thing you really need to know is that now every room in my house has a switch that goes between colour and black and white. Black and white lighting is carbon neutral, did you know that? It's true. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for, possibly maybe some of you, the origins of my horrendous username. Our story starts way back in 2004. I don't know why I'm doing this dramatic voice, but I think I'm going to stick with it. I've lost it. Damn. I was 11 years old, and I just found out about the magical world of Ruinsky. When I came to create my character, the name Mike had gone! <laughs> okay, okay, I'm gonna stop using that voice now because this story really doesn't warrant it. Now you see, this was the first time in my life that I'd had to use a name other than Mike for anything online. So I thought to my 11 year old self, hmm, I want them to know I'm called Mike, but then I also want them to think I'm really good. In fact, I want them to think I'm the best. And I came up with the very modest name, Mike the Best. Unfortunately, I wasn't the only arrogant little kid called Mike, and Mike the Best had already been taken. The site offered me Mike the Best 1, but I didn't want to share my username with anyone. So I went back to the drawing board, and through a mixture of me liking the letter Z, and thinking the French for the was Z, I came up with the equally arrogant but easier to say, Mike Zibest. Now I didn't actually ever become Zibest on RuneScape, but the username, as usernames tend to do, stuck. Over the years I began to realise that Mike Zibest is a very embarrassing name for a person. So I decided to change my name. Oh great, the dramatic voice is back. But I couldn't fully let go of the name I'd had for my entire internet life. So I shortened it to MZB and added my date of birth because YouTube wouldn't let me have any three character username. And I vowed that day to take my secret shame to the grave. Or you know, just didn't tell anyone until the subject came up in one of my videos. And you can laugh, but your laugh will be hollow. Because you know that you will never be. Ha ha ha! Okay, so after that, is there really one more thing I need to tell you about myself? I sometimes do this really stupid thing where I'm like, like if something, don't if something else, and then it's all pretty embarrassing, but I just put it at the end of my videos, it's just force of habit really. So yeah, um, with that, like if you liked, don't if you didn't, thanks for watching guys. Oh, one last thing. Um, sometimes I do a little extra clip after the end of my video. Kind of like this.